Shut up and sit down. Hey, I'm Simon. I'm not. Hey, not. Uh, I don't know how to respond to that at all, but uh, if you like our silly videos, then please remember to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell thing next to the subscribe button. That would be very kind of you. Mm -hmm. And tonight we're drinking a couple of drinks that are called... Mango Monsters. Mango Monsters? Why are they called Mango Monsters? Because they taste like mango and might kill us. Ah, oh, they really do. And uh, one of us is not allowed to make drinks anymore. Oh, I'm sorry. And uh, we are surprising each other with trailers that, and the other, terrifying uh, drinks. that the other person has not yet seen. So what trailer do we have next? Well, next we have the full trailer for a trailer that we, we were teased by quite a while ago. And even our reaction, the teaser trailer was 30 seconds long. And our reaction to that teaser was probably one of our more popular videos. Just because the topic is so intriguing to so many people, as is the lead actor. Mm. So I want to check out the full trailer now, which only came out today, but people are losing their minds over. Let's go lose our minds. Let's do it. And we will be back after this to let you know what we think, unless these mango monsters kill us first. <laughs> Welcome to Willy's Wonderland. Spend the night cleaning Willy's Wonderland, and I will pay to have your car fixed. <laughs> you know, I'm Castor Troy! Officially on staff. Let's get the hell out of here. I can't stand to hear a grown man scream. <laughs> this place has a dark history. I know the bullshit story they told you. It's a lot. You're uh... here to be a human sacrifice. Have you been listening to a word I've been saying? He's gonna die in here, but he won't listen to me. Oh, no way. Oh, that's awesome. How many nights of Freddy's? <laughs> the machines got out. Oh, you safe. Put your balls on, Evan. We're going to Willie's. He's not trapped in here with them. We're trapped in here with him. <laughs> it's birthday time. I enjoy a man a few words. <laughs> Oh, nice! Wow! So we have finally seen the full trailer for Willy's Wonderland, basically the Five Nights at Freddy's movie, coming on February 12th, finally! How do they get away with making Five Nights at Freddy's without calling it Five Nights at Freddy's? Maybe because you give it the most ridiculous title. So nobody will suspect. You sneak it under that radar. Oh, you pretend it's a porno when it's actually <laughs> yes. a horrific R-rated horror movie. Yeah, although is it? I mean, there definitely look to be some pretty extreme horror elements here. But the animatronics? I mean, the animatronics are probably going to murder some people. Let's, mm -hmm. let's be straight up there. There was some blood splatter. But was it blood splatter or was it oil from the veins of the deadly animatronics? Probably blood splatter. Probably both. Um, and in the Five Nights at Freddy's universe, there are children or souls of children stuck in these animatronics. It's pretty Ooh. gory stuff. So, yeah, I'm really, really intrigued. It, it definitely feels very FNAF-esque, right? Mm -hmm. But there's a lot of other cool stuff in there. I mean, Nicolas Cage... You, it looks like you see him go full cage in this movie. There's dancing, there's him just smashing the holy crap out of everything. They're stuck in here with him. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, those murderous animatronics don't know what they got themselves into. It's your birthday. He's probably just going to recite that uh, Nicolas Cage's History of Swear Words script straight back at them. Yeah. 
I am really like Nicolas Cage makes some really peculiar choices. I can't. I don't know where he's at with this. This is either, like, this has got to be the best movie that's ever been made. Only because Nicolas Cage makes weird choices and he's chosen this. And I, I mean, he has got to have kids around the same age as ours to be obsessed, to, to even consider a part in a movie like this. Hmm. Yeah, that's interesting. I, uh, you know, he just seems to be an insanely hard worker. I mean, he did that terrible jujitsu movie. He did the history of swear words. Now he's in Willy's Wonderland. He's just all over the map. Yeah. During a year where virtually nobody else was working because everything was shut down, Nicolas Cage has made like eight movies and a yeah. TV show. He's uh, so I don't know Maybe whether he's a robot. Oh, an animatronic. Man, I think you might be onto something then, Robo Cage. Mm. <laughs> I, I don't know whether he makes weird choices or he just chooses every opportunity that comes along. And, and you know, I, I read somewhere that Nicolas Cage is one of those peculiar actors who can be good in a great movie, but he can be an absolute savior in a terrible movie. And I think we've seen some terrible movies that Nicolas Cage didn't quite save. Mm. But he never fails to be entertaining. Yeah. Like, I, and, you know, I, I don't mind a movie not being Oscar winning material as long as I have a blast. Like, we just watched Shadow in the Cloud, and it wasn't a great movie by any means. I thought it was a great movie. But we had a blast watching it, right? Yeah. It's not going to win any Oscars. No one's getting any Academy Awards. But it was a great entertaining movie. Mm. And Nicolas Cage kind of brings that same quality to pretty much everything he touches. Um, I am really impressed with how spooky and creepy and scary the animatronics look. Like, they look kind of goofy and dumb at the beginning, and then you see those heads come peeking around mm. the corner, and the creepy voices. Um, I, yeah, I was... I, I don't know if I was terribly... I mean, Five Nights at Freddy's as a game is scary. Like, if you haven't yeah. played it, the, the first game you're a security guard who's basically stuck in a room with a flashlight. There are various doors open, and you're watching on security cameras as these animatronics suddenly disappear from one room and end up right next to your face. Mm -hmm. There's a virtual reality version where you're literally there as a security guard, shining your lights around, hearing your own panicked breathing in your head. It's... Mm -hmm. It's pretty intense. I wasn't sure how animatronics were going were gonna to transfer onto the big screen, but this gives me hope that they could actually be pretty scary. It looks like a lot of fun. And yes. it's rare that there is a movie that we think we would enjoy and that our teenagers would enjoy. Yeah, and our teenagers are obsessed with Five Nights at Freddy's. I wonder if this will be FNAF-esque enough for them, if they'll think it's a cheap knockoff. Um, they do like Nick Cage, though. They really like... I mean, who doesn't? <laughs> the Academy Award Ooh. givers? Ah, uh, burn. Well, they don't deserve him. He's he, too good. For yeah, them. exactly. He's above there. He transcends genres. Yes. Well, then I, I guess we will come back after February 15th when this comes out to let you know what we and our teenagers thought about it. But for now, we are pretty damn excited to see Willy's Wonderland. Mm -hmm. And if you're not there cleaning Willy's Wonderland all night long to get a free car wash or whatever it was they said at the beginning, <laughs> that was a line in the trailer. Fix your car, because he went over the spikes. Oh, yeah, that's right. Which I'm sure the animatronics placed there. They're very spiky. Yeah, but if you're not cleaning your willy all night long, then we hope that you will come back and see us again tomorrow. We always Be have to go there. Yeah, that's what she said. Uh, because we do this every single day. Mm-hmm. Every single day. For you, and therefore we will see you tomorrow, friends, on the next drunk trailer, Willy's Wonderlandy FNAF kinda ambush. Birthday time. <laughs> Shut up and sit down.